Mike, Red Fox, a little bit of a different one today. We're gonna do vlog style, where I'm gonna walk you through everything I have going on here in the basement, out in the garage, all the things I'm thinking, all the work I have to do, improvements I wanna make. I guess we're just doing a brain dump in this video, because I'm feeling pretty overwhelmed. How do we do this? I'm gonna, here, let me flip this around. Not really a vlog guy. Bring the camera over here. Okay, all right, I think that's pretty good. Let's back it up a little bit. Oh, this is my setup. Hey, there it is. If you haven't seen it in a different angle, there you go. We're gonna walk through it and just kind of like all the stuff <laughs> that is just sitting around. This is my favorite. We'll start with my favorite. Those are three thirty eighties sitting on my son's little thing there. Just hanging out because I have no space to put anything anymore. But yeah, there it is. There's just a basement setup in my house is where I do everything. It's a whole YouTube slash crypto setup, and there's just a lot that's been going on, and I'm just trying to get everything back online and cleaned up and make some adjustments to my space down here so I can make it really useful. And it's just, it's all a lot. So I don't know where to start exactly, but um, maybe just like the shelf behind me that has just turned into just like a GPU graveyard of sorts, I guess. And um, there's a lot back here, and they're all kind of like in various, little tight, sorry for the close-up camera, various stages of things. So like some of these cars just, like let's see, I think I have some 5700 XTs. Yeah, here's one. I think this is a 5700 or 5700 XT. It's kind of like chilling back here, because I don't know if they make any money anymore. Should I sell those? Let me know down in the comment section below. There's the one that like went on fire. I don't know if you guys saw the video on that. I'll leave it linked up in the card up there. That one went on fire. It's all black. It still works. Just got to clean it. Dead fans on this Asus Dual 3070. Got to fix that. I hate my 3080 Ti's. So they're back here because I don't like them at all. I don't know what to do with those. There's a bunch of them back here. Even like the 6700 XT's I think are still pretty good. But I got to just figure out what to do with them. There's like an A4000 behind that. Zotac, you know why you're here. Yep, there it is. There it is. You know why you're there. Shout out Zotac fans. Shout them out. Okay, what else? I don't know. It's kind of, yeah. Shout out all you. Keeping it going. Um, this wall is a mess. So question I have for all of you, what do you do with your boxes for GPUs? Because I have a lot of boxes for GPUs and I don't know necessarily what to do with them. These ones are cool because they're on display behind me, but this is a lot of shelf space. I want to get back and we'll go through that in a second. Power supply boxes. These are all 580s. I think, I don't know what to do with those. I should probably get rid of those. Oh man. Oh, this is my favorite. There's the 4070 Super on the test bench. Just chilling on the floor because I have no room for anything. <laughs> I don't know when I'm releasing this video, but I just built this 12 card 6600 rig. That was a big win, getting some GPUs back online. Big personal win right there. That thing's up and mining. Doing really great, still dialing in some overclocks. Uh, where should we go next? Here. Six 3070 Ti's. Just hanging out because I got to clean them. I also hate these cards. See that fan's broken. They're in horrible condition absolute heartbreakers. They still work just fine. I just got to clean them up. One of those power supplies is broken. I don't know which one. I got to test it. Octo miner with a bunch of 3090s. I don't know where the other ones went. They're somewhere. I got to figure that out. I got to fix that server case. That's just a mess of a Veta frame. More Veta frames. I've kind of moved on from the Veta frames. Yeah, so that's cool. There's a, a 4090 and a 3090 that I keep thinking I'm going to knock over because they're in the worst possible place. It's another server case I got to fix, which I got parts for. Thank you, Mineshop. Man, we're just getting started here. It's already feeling like a lot. Um, we'll come back to like kind of the YouTube mining setup in a second. Oh, grow tent. That doesn't, I don't use it anymore. So I got to take all that down because it's just become storage. And it's become stored. Let's see what let's see what we got. Some more GPU boxes. Here's uh, you're gonna hate me for this one. 
There's five A2000s I never opened. It's been a while. Oh, speaking of never opened, helium miners never opened. Those are a couple years old. Oh, plus like all of the new egg combo stuff. Like there's a cooler. There's another one over there for CPUs. There is a whole CPU right there. Focus right there. Power supplies. There's motherboards. Just, just a lot of stuff back there. I should probably sell, recoup some, some of my money. There's my server. I run some flux nodes and some other things, all my networking. There's a damaged Octaminer that they sent me. They sent me a replacement, but that one came damaged. Just been taking parts out of it and using it in other things. The Caspa, KSO, whatever. Some iPolo, whatever thing over there. Broken power supply, got to recycle. C1100 FPGA. Hanging out right there. Love that thing. On just some monstrosity of a mining rig I built once upon a time that is is just it's horrible pride and joy 30 series card test rig 12 30 series cards one of every one on there it's off right now because i'm doing that thing yeah and then so like i gotta like there's power i ran there power in there i don't really use anymore because i gotta take all this down everything's out in the garage now so my whole like grow tent set up has been decommissioned. I just gotta take it down and get this space back. But I gotta get stuff out of there. And I have plans for the grow tent because I am a gardener. So I'm gonna do some hydroponics in there. On the other side of the basement, that'll be fun. But yeah, so I guess kind of like setup wise, then I can get a space back there, maybe put another bench or table for some more testing or like a whole nother camera setup. And then all of this, I wanna just get rid of everything on there. That way I can put my test bench, which is still on the floor, permanently over there. Probably a couple test rigs with power meters hooked up all the time. So I can just slot GPUs in and out and just always have a place for them to do some testing. So I just gotta, I gotta figure out what to do with all these boxes. Do I throw them out? I feel like they're good for resale do I put them in, I'm thinking like, do I put them in a big garbage bag and just hide them <laughs> somewhere else so I can clear up this whole space? <sighs> I, don't, I don't know what to do, I don't know what to do. But yeah, I wanna do that over there and then I wanna get a new overhead camera. I'm thinking, hey, camera people, I'm thinking A6700 up there. You let me know what you think about that. I use a, what do I use now? I use a A74 or something. What does it say on this thing? Yeah, A74, like the newest one is what I'm using. <laughs> Terrible, is what I'm using. <laughs> um, yeah, so that's that's this. But there's more, because this is not all my mining stuff. My main mining setup's out in the garage, so we should go take a look at that. All right, out in the garage, this is the main mining setup. You can see my two shelves there. A lot of stuff online, some stuff still offline. A lot of cleaning I still have to do, but we'll start over here. So. 12 card 3070 Octaminer online, doing really well, except one card is dead. But I just gotta take this whole thing down. It's like a whole day project, probably. All the 16 series, that's uh, how many? 16 of them, they're all offline. I don't think they make any money, do they? Let me know down in the comment section. All the little mini A6 offline, they don't make any money. Black Miner. F1 FPGA down there, doesn't make any money. Ooh, hey puppy, hi, hi Indy. I say hello to YouTube, you're so beautiful. All right, back over here. Starting at the bottom, 12 car 6600 XT rig, doing really well. That's I think eight more 6600 XTs in a server case, doing really well. 3060 Ti's over here, also doing well. And then that's 12 3070's in that frame there, doing really well. And we got those already. And then coming up to some of the A6, that's an iPolo something that's still mining. Jazz Miner's still going. And then 6 3060's up in the top. 
there. So everything over here is doing really well. The temperatures are great. Let's take a look. It's winter time, 74 degrees, and I have this fan on the lowest setting, 20% humidity. That's the AC Infinity fan, highly recommend. So one thing I gotta figure out, and I would love any recommendations that you have. Right now we're good, it's winter. In summer and spring and fall, I leave this door open to get some intake in over all of this stuff and then out. Problem, pulls in a lot of pollen and outside stuff. You can see some of these cars I still haven't cleaned. Let's see, where's the founders? Yeah, you can see a lot of the pollen still on there. Also, see if we can sneak back here, you can see some oxidation I'm getting on the Octo Miner from the salt air. So I need a filter, I need to filter this. Intake, there's a screen door I close, but it's not enough. So I gotta build some kind of box or something over this, because I do need that fresh air coming in when the temperatures get really warm. But I'm not sure what to do. Maybe some like marine grade filter, which is gonna reduce the airflow coming in. Uh, hopefully there's an expert out there that can help me out. Let me know in the comment section or please on Discord. I need some help. Let's uh, head back in the basement and wrap this one up. Okay, I think that was probably pretty much everything. I'm sure I missed something. I think I missed the Jazz Miner, which is heating up the back room right now, but I think I got pretty much everything else in this video and most of the things that I'm thinking. Do you have any advice for me? Please let me know down in the comment section because I could certainly use some help. But otherwise, take care of yourself, each other, like button, subscribe. See you in the next video. Cheers.